Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Battletech. Uh, the last episode, we got, uh, well, we finally, I think, got back onto the main story. So that was like the tutorial bits that we've previously been playing. Because uh, we figured out Lady Arano is alive. Kamei Arano is alive. And now she's hired us or taken us on uh, and has agreed to pay off all of our debts uh, if we work for her. So that's a thing. Uh, but before we do anything else, we got Welcome a new mech. Base, Commander. Uh, not uh, we got a new mech in the last uh, in the last. Uh, okay, oh, we got multiple bays. I completely forgot. Yeah, we have multiple bays, so we can have shit. We could have uh, twelve. Yeah, we could have uh, quite a few mechs if they're all the same. Because if they're if it's six and six and six, then you know it. I don't know if it's going to be the same though, because that's the thing. Uh, I know you can get different classes of upgrades, so maybe one bay will only be four. I'm not sure about that, but still, pretty cool. So that would give us, uh, what, uh, six and six on top of that? Would be, yeah, that'd be 18. Yeah, 18. So that would be pretty nice, 18 mechs. All right, well, we need to repair you. Yes, repair. Need to repair you. Need to repair you. You need a refit. Replace the arm. Do we have an MG? Yes, we do. MG goes there. Let's repair all. I think that's it. Yep, 20 tons. Confirm. Yeah. Confirm that. On it. I'll let you know when that's done. Okay, let's get the refit of this going. Okay, so we need three jump jets. We have the equipment for that. Uh, we got two. Let's get uh, let's get a couple more jump jets from the store. I think there's a store on this place. Yep. Let's see if we can pick up a couple. Equipment jump jets. I would like to buy one. New equipment two. available. Okay, picked up two of those. Bay. Let's get the spider ready to go on our normal uh, our normal loadout. There we go. Confirm. I'll take five days. Confirm that. Right. I'll get it in the schedule. Then we have this Centurion. It's only got one medium laser. Okay. You've got an you've got a ballistic mount. You've got a couple rocket mounts. We put a heavy. Can we put a large laser on here? Yes, we can. It's got a large laser. Armor looks good from what I'm seeing right now because these are little armor bars. We got front and rear. Front and rear, yeah, that looks good. Um, I'm thinking, do we have an AC5 that we could put on here? We got AC2, so we got AC5 ammo. So I would like to put an AC5 on this thing. Give it some punch. Let's revert, head back. Let's pick up AC-5 and some missiles at the store. Building up our first mech. Yep, yeah, that's an AC-5. Buy one of those. New weapon systems available. Let's see here. I would like to pick up... Uh, Let's pick up an LRM-5 plus. LRM-5 plus. So I guess that's a little little better. Yeah, bonus plus one damage. Okay, that's good. New weapon systems available. Is there LRM-5 ammo? And we got LRM ammo. We'll pick up one of those. New equipment available. Okay. That looks pretty good. Bays. 
to refit this. It may not be the exactly the most battle ready, but uh, we'll we'll get it going. Let's get an AC5 in here. Nice. Safety so AC5's up. What is this? Support weapon hardpoint. Do we have a support weapon? Small laser. Yeah. Put a small laser on there. Why not? Well, I have to put heat, sink heat sinks on the torsos. Or in the head. Mm, not sure about that. Okay. Uh, MG ammo. Put that in the torso. Now let's have one or more weapons that require ammo. Mecha's carrying ammo that it cannot use. Oh, we don't need MG because we're using a small laser. Ugh. Uh, we need AC5 ammo. Let's put two of that in there. Okay, it's got missile mounts, that looks like, and a laser mount in the center chest. Let's put on the large laser. Nice. Okay. Let's get some heat sinks in this bad boy. Two heat sinks there. One in the head. One in the CT. It's heat efficiency. I'd like to have one more put it there. I guess we don't really need it. We'll do that. We'll, we'll do that. That gives it a pretty good heat efficiency. Uh, we do need the missiles up there. So we did have an LRM-5 plus. Put that in there. And we need LRM ammo. Guess we'll put that... Uh, ooh, ooh, ooh. Put one in the arm. Ooh, we can't. Alright, I guess we'll get rid of one of the heat sinks in the chest. Unused tonnage. Hmm. What are we gonna do? Uh, well, let's increase our rear armor for our chest a little bit. Forty. Forty. Front armor a bit. There we go. Full armor. So that gives us an AC5, LRM5 plus with ammo, a medium and a large laser, and then one small laser if they get any close. Heat efficiencies. Yeah, I don't think we'll alpha strike a lot because we have a lot of mixed range weapons. Firepower is all right. Average range is pretty good. We'll do this. We'll do this. Confirm. I don't know if this is a good build or not. Uh, I'm sure there's probably, like, already guides up by the time this Long video comes out. No. Of good builds, but we'll figure it out. Oh, let's go to the store as well. I think we can sell some shit. Let's see. What can we sell? Uh, no max, no max that we can sell. Okay. Okay, well, we've got a lot of uh, max in the bay getting worked on. Financial report in 20 days, 40 days before Centurion actually comes out of its uh, its uh, repair or refit. Got a million C bills in the bank. Let's go to contracts, see what we got. Cease and desist. We have reliable information that a remote Canopean laboratory is attempting to reverse engineer sensitive local government technology in violation of the usage license. They have failed to respond to our communications uh, that they cease and desist these unlawful operations. Therefore, we authorize you to execute the license termination clause upon that facility. Travel to Detroit, 22 days. That'll give our mechs enough time to work out stuff. That's decent money. And uh, good rep. 
good salvage too. Potential good salvage. Remember, these are all maxed. Trap sprung. We're getting a number of reports that agents on the ground of a powerful mech uh, sporting pirate colors. A single mech operating on its own out in the middle of nowhere sounds like a trap. Our plan is to spring this trap and see who comes to investigate. Engage the mech, intercept the forces, intercept the forces the local pirate organizations send to defend it, and destroy all of them. Forewarned is forearmed, sure, but it's still meant to be a trap. This could get dicey. Yeah, it definitely could. Why don't we go for this one? Head out to Detroit, see what's going on. Let's negotiate. Average here. Uh... Okay, well, let's do that. Five, one five. Get to pick one. Take five. I guess we don't get to... Cannot gain reputation with this faction. Oh, it's a local government faction. Okay. Uh, let's try... Let's try middle of the road. Middle of the road. Everything middle, we'll just keep it like that. It's 2-8 and uh, 73,000. It's fairly good. Let's accept that, and they'll pay for our uh, our trip to Detroit. By your command. Should give our boys enough time to fix up the mechs, repair everything from the last mission. Organized chaos. In the morning briefing, Yang jumps right in it. Commander, the leopard is too small. My mech techs keep tripping over everything. Chief, we've talked about this, Darius says in exasperation. We can't exactly knock down any walls. Uh, Samire uh, inserts herself. Is, is, is it Samire? I think it's Samire. What if we moved some supplies into other parts of the Leopard? The bunks, kitchen, hell. I'll even store some boxes in the cockpit if it'll help. Tell you to make do. We'll move smell amount of supplies, fill every corner. Move. We'll go middle of the road here. Over the next several days, everyone helps move the least critical mech bay supplies to other parts of the Leopard. But emotions get heated over the next week. Glitch gets particularly upset when she trips over an unexpected box of tools. Before long, Yang and his technicians reclaim their supplies. His mood, at least, is much better than everyone else's. When you arrive in the mech bay, he is grimly satisfied that the amount of reorganizations he's, he's managed in a short period of time. Company gets a plus one tech point for boost for... Ooh, 14 days. That'll boost our repair. Glitch has gained the following tags for 30 days. Low spirits. Aw, glitch. Yeah, that shortened up our repair time quite a bit. That used to be like 40 days, so that, that knocked it down a little bit. Alright, keep going. <sighs> Shadowhawks back up. By the time we get to Detroit... We'll probably have uh, most of the mechs back up. Alright, now we wait for the uh, jump into the Detroit system. Right, I, guess it, I guess it doesn't actually have to be the Detroit system. I think we... It's supposed to be quite a long trip, if I recall, so we might not be in Detroit. We may have to go from one jump ship to the next. wonder if that's a thing that's in this game. I don't exactly remember totally how the... Uh, oh yeah, we're in the Detroit system. I don't remember exactly how the whole uh, jump ship thing works. The last cup. On your way to the Leopard's Galley, uh, you run into Sir... Samire. Samire. I'm going to say Samire. Heading the same way. Commander, it's been a long week. I know I can't make more hours in the... I know I can't make more hours in the day. But I could make... I can make more coffee... When you enter the cramped galley, you find Medusa and Behemoth in a tense standoff in front of the nearly empty coffee pot. Uh, Medusa uh, sees you. Commander, this is our last of the coffee. The XO says we don't have any more until our next supply run. Let's put the coffee between them. Give the coffee to Smire. Take the coffee for yourself. Uh... Split it between us. Come on, guys. We're not kids. Exasperated, you squeeze your way past them into the galley and take two cups. Pouring the coffee equally into both, you say, If you can't act like adults, we'll have to resolve this like your children. 
You hand one cup to Medusa and one to Behemoth. Drink up. The next time I send you planets, I'd expect you to take uh, uh, to make every single shot. After they leave, uh, Smire sighs as he stares at the, as she stares at the empty cup. That's be- that better have been worth it. Now excuse me while I go discuss shopping priorities with Darius. Medusa and Behemoth both get high spirits. Nice. Offsets uh, Glitch being on low spirits. Got four days before we're actually in the system. Whenever you are. Okay, we still have the bank payment that we're making. Okay. Doing alright so far. Let's keep our normal, uh, normal operating costs. Two days. We've entered orbit, Commander. We've entered orbit of Detroit. We've arrived at Detroit, Commander. Ready to proceed with our current contract? Not yet. Just want to check our mech bays. Yeah, they're all up. So our, our largest mech is our medium Shadowhawk at 55 tons. Even the uh, Centurions, uh, just a class medium 50 tonner. Would be nice to pick up maybe a, a larger mech. Actually, let's let's just check the store. We're not going to be able to afford it because mechs are expensive. I would just like to see what we got for mechs. Locust, Panthers, 35 ton medium, I'm pretty sure. No, it's a light. Yeah, these are partial salvage. Yeah, we don't have any salvage we can give up. Okay. Well, that's something. Let's check the hiring hall. What do we got on this planet? Standing by. This mech warrior will only work for you if you have a, a mercenary review board rating of 200 or higher. How do we find that out? What's our... Do we find our rating? I don't know. Uh, do contracts? I don't know. Reputation. There we go. Rating of forty. Jesus. Okay, we were a little while. It's a little ways away then, huh? Okay. I would also like to check this since we haven't done it in a while. Check the star map. What do we got for systems? Oh, wow. Quite a large area to go into. And we also have the Directorate now. And that's the Concordat, Federated Sons, the uh, Confederation, Merrick. That's the Magistry. Okay. Hmm. Well, we'll have to look into that. Alright. Let's go ahead and launch this contract. Shadowhawk, Locust, Vindicator, and Blackjack. Eh, I like that. Glitch has got low spirits. Suffering from low spirits have cost the morale abilities increase. So, okay, so she won't be able to do called shots as uh, cheaply anymore. That's not bad. We can do that. Alright, destroy base is what we're looking for right now. See, what I really want to do is, if we can get it, I want to get a cicada. And if you don't, like a cicada is a is a 45 ton medium. It's fast medium. I I play that almost exclusively in MechWarrior Online. Uh, violation of license agreement. We know this. Uh, contract does not specify any retrieval, Commander. We are to bring the base down and destroy the tech with it. All right. Destroy enemy structures and escape. So this is how the future sent, we send our heard the future like cease and desist letters. We just send in a, a highly trained me uh, like Commander, mechanized mercenary unit. Commander, we're here to shut down the research a research base. Approach the base and destroy the designated buildings. Okay. Be wary of the base defenders and watch for any additional patrols in the area. Good hunting, Commander. Should have brought a coat. Hey, don't complain. This is this is tundra territory, which means heat's going to be minimal. 
Yeah, looks like we're gonna be unsteady the whole way there. Don't need to tell me twice. Alright. Let's move in. Got it. Enemy contact! New bogey on the field. We got a mech. Okay, so we got a mech. Unknown, unknown, unknown. Turret. Turret. Something else. And I can tell they're turrets because they got their arm on top of a pedestal, which means they have to be a turret. Medium reinforced building. Can I see what the hell this is? There we go. Medium reinforced building. Large reinforced building. Medium reinforced building. Medium buildings. Okay, I was looking to see if there was a uh, turret generator somewhere around here. Alright. Medusa. G you up near the top. Spot him for us, please. Brace. They did nothing. Alright. Behemoth, move up. Move order received. And crest this hill as a unit. Let's try and blitz them. What are they doing? There it is. Vehicle. Vehicle and mech. We'll have me go up there. I'm going to sprint up. All right. Good to go. Glitch, I need you up there with the rest as well. Got it. Max speed, no shooting. I have a Vindicator in Mech Warrior Online. I, I think I just have it. I think I just have it with twin PPCs on it. Then again, it's probably a different class or type. We're gonna reserve to three. Let them go. Then we'll go over in one. Oh, here he is. The alpha, the alpha glitch. Nice try. He also made a huge mistake, like a massive mistake. Oh, you dumb fucked up now. We're not gonna melee you. Is that within minimum range? Target moved. Let's do a called shot on this guy. No AC2s. But I want you to just shoot him right in the right in the face. Fire. Engaging target. There goes his SRM4. What else I got moving? What the hell was that? Mm, oh well. Standing by. Let's see here. Oh yeah, we'll take that shot. Fire. Roger that. Medium laser crit. Had that taste. Yeah, vehicle's coming around. Yes, Commander. Yes, I want you to go up there and punch this thing. Gaging. Left leg down. And there she goes. I hear ya. Uh. What can I do for ya? Uh, I 
What do we want to do? Move you up. Yeah, we'll move you up. Got it. Get sight on this. What do we got? Medium reinforced building or light shredder turret. Light shredder turret, definitely. Fire. Special delivery. And it's down. Pretty good hit with the missiles. Systems holding. I've been sensor locked. Miss and a couple of small hits. Nothing big. You got nothing. You hear me? Yes, Commander. All right, Medusa, take a shot. There's the left arm. Left torso. Is it not dead yet, for the love of God? Uh, Waiting for orders. Let's have Glitch move up a bit. Take another shot at that other turret. I read you, Commander. Moving out. All right. And fire. Here we go. Target destroyed. Well, he's coming around behind us. Just not really doing a lot. All right, can we kill this thing for, like, uh, please? Can we? You know what? Fuck it. Target, I want you to hit the leg. Engaging target. Both legs destroyed, there we go. Enemy mech destroyed. See, if you knock out both legs, they can't fight you anymore. Commander. Okay, there goes those turrets. Move Behemoth over here, knock out this other vehicle that's trying to come around behind us. At least try to. And fire. Target acquired. It's their turn. Their vehicle's moving back. Something's here, but I don't know what it is. Just running over all these buildings over here. Uh, let's move back over this direction. Yeah, you can get a shot, looks like. Looks like another scorpion there. Okay. Just shoot. Copy that. Damn, thing's still alive. Miss. Really long range shot, kind of stupid to take it. Okay, well. Orders. Behemoth, why don't you move up over here? Actually, why don't you go there? Want to clear out the patrols. Okay. Not that one. That one. Fire. Here it comes. Good hit. Good hit. Vehicle down. Is that other vehicle trying to come around behind us? Taking its sweet time. I just have the locusts go ahead and like on, run over to melee them or something. 
Uh, let's just make an attack on this building. Fire. Got it. Enemy structure damage. Commander. That's one decent hit there. And this is us. Well, should probably just start moving up. Not seeing much in the way of enemies. Uh, yeah, decent hit there. We'll just use the lasers. Fire. Engaging target. Good shot, Commander. Enemy structure down. That's one down. Here comes the striker. Jesus, those missiles. Wow. Energetic little bastards, aren't they? Well, looks like another shredder turret back there somewhere. Yeah. Well, let's have Locust sprint over here. It's gonna have to deal with that other vehicle in the rear while the big boys deal with the objective. There we go, that's good. Here it comes. Did not get close enough, it looks like. What's up, Bach? Hemoth, I want you just to uh, kill this thing. Yeah, just kill it. Uh, you know what? Make a precision strike right on the turret. Fire. Giving him everything I've got. Still alive, because we missed the AC-5. That's the thing that is killing those what things. What can I do for you? Move up over here. You betcha. Deal with that other shredder turret. I actually don't have the shredder turret in sight. That sucks. Uh Yeah, it doesn't really matter. Just hit that one, I guess. Tell me what to shoot. Yeah, we'll just wait here and shoot AC twos and fire. Engaging target. Target building destroyed. Nice. Two of four. We got two more to go, and fifty percent of the base garrison is destroyed. Striker just keeps trading oh. shots with this. Oh. Sorry, Commander. Oh okay. shit. Warning. Enemy sensor lock detected. Eh, not, Warning. Armor low. Not too bad. Ready for orders. Eh, we'll go there. On my way. Go there, hit that vehicle. It's a galleon. Yep, let's shoot it. Firing. All wet. Hey, good shot, Locust. Yeah, Finally. Stay down. Must have got lucky and uh, breached through the armor with that laser. Then the machine guns finished it off. Good to go. Glitch. I want you to move up. Moving out. And then I want you to hit that. Roger that. Firing on target. All right. For orders. Behemoth. Receiving you. Can you take a shot? No. Actually, why is that? Minimum range. Got it.
Eh, I guess we're just gonna have to shoot. Fire. Roger that. Nice. Base garrison's down. Reporting. Enemy vehicle eliminated. So why don't we move in here? Get ourselves some evasion. It's a good shot. So is that one. Yeah, we'll damage this one and uh, Glitch can get the other one next round. Engaging target. Nice! One shot, one kill. Target building. Destroyed. Our turn. Yep. Well, that's Medusa. Just head him back over here. He doesn't really have anything else to do, in all honesty. Race. Hey, go. not Behemoth. Waiting for orders. Glitch. Take your shot. Fire. Uh huh. Get your lance to the LZ commander. I'm coming in hot. All right. Let's get to the LZ, which is on the other side of the map. Awesome. Ooh, frame rate kind of tanked. I guess it's all that fire effects and destroyed buildings and stuff. We'll brace him. Commander. Behemoth, I want you to sprint. You're going down that way. You can add any wayward vehicles that may still be there. Here's nothing. Wow, okay. Hi, hi. Dusa, I want you to sprint. Move in that direction. Okay, he's got good evasion up. I hear ya. Glitch, you're sprinting. All the way over there. Getting to the LZ. Me. Okay. Sprinting. Okay. Yes, Commander. Behemoth. You can move up over here, and you can get a shot with the LRMs on that uh, shredder turret. Fire. Target acquired. All right, shot. Nothing big. Minor hits. Damage minimal. Okay, we got Medusa. What do you need? Well, I don't need much. Just keep moving them up. Brace him. Move up here. Take the shot with our alpha strike. Yep, fire. All weapons committed. That's down. Target destroyed. Waiting on you, Commander. Okay, glitch. 
You're sprinting up. Sprinting. Gotta get to that uh, drop zone or that LZ landing zone. Standing by. Copy that. Okay. Dusa, you need to sprint. You'll be in the landing zone. There we go. Need you to sprint. Almost there. Trying as far as we can, we're almost there. Essentially, the mission's over. We could hit the other Shredder turret, which I think might mean we wouldn't have to go to the LZ, but at this point, we're so close, it doesn't really matter. Kind of funny, Behemoth got, what, two missions? One, two missions? And then she got hit again? Injured again? Hopefully it's not as long as the first uh, time she got injured. Reserve him. Waiting for the shot. Orders. Behemoth, you're gonna sprint up there. On the move, full speed. There you are. What can I do for you? Glitch, put you in there. Affirmative. I may turn down the frequency of those sprinting cams. It seems kind of pointless. And there we go. We're in. And we're out. All contract targets eliminated. That was a good day's work, Commander. Mission successful. Nice. Let's see what we got. Hey, we got the secondary. Destroy the base garrisons. Contract payment increased by 25%. Nice, 92,000. Well done, Commander. We obviously placed our faith in the right mercenary company. We'll let you know if we have any other work for you. Okay, next. Let's see here. Yeah, you're out for a couple of days. You've been injured. We'll see how well that was. We got one mech kill on me, and then everyone else got at least one vehicle kill. Nice. Next. We got two choices. We'll take the Jenner part. Let's see, what else do we want? Small lasers are kind of useless. Well, let's take the uh, AC-5. Confirm. We got some smaller things there. Good. Cool. Hey, and we got one more, and we'll, one more part, and we'll have a full Jenner. Nice. Continue. I wonder if there's a way, a place you can find that on the menus. I'd love to know how many, uh, like how close we are to some max. That'd be nice. Because I know we picked up a cicada salvage. I think Lady Arano's contract to liberate. Uh, well dry is ready for review in the uh, command center. We should follow up when you think we're ready. Okay. That mech you asked for is cleared for fighting. Mech chassis is complete. Oh, we did get a Jenner. Jenner D's run hot and they run fast, but they can quickly bound into combat to deliver a knockout punch, even against heavier units. Their capability with speed and weaponry tends to come at the expense of lower armor capacity, though. So we do have a Jetter D. Nice, we could sell that. Uh, no empty bays. You may place your new mechs in a storage bay or replace a mech currently on the mech bay by storing uh, or scrapping it instead. Stored mech chassis are stripped of weapons, equipment, and ready in combat. Uh...
Send to storage. Store it up. I'd like to... Well, yeah, before we go, let's make this an even 50-minute episode. Why not? So is there any upgrades we can pick up for the leopard, is what I'm wondering. Because that would be the thing I'd want to know. I think we talk to... Uh, customize company, finances, reputation. Can we talk to Cerami? How can I help, Commander? Ceram? Uh, questions about navigation. No. Good day, Commander. Don't need navigation. Would it be Yang that I'd talk to? Anything I can do? Uh, a few questions about the mech bay. Don't like yourself. No. Nope. Talk to you later. Let's see if we can talk mm -hmm. to him. Does he got anything? What can we? Can we anything? Contracts, mech warrior, fine. No. Nope. Damn it. I'll have to look that up. I'll see you. Okay, well, I think that was a pretty good episode, So, uh, and we're definitely over time, so thank you for joining me for this episode. If you'd like to, please leave a comment down below, so hit that like button. If you want to support the channel, consider that subscribe button, as well as taking a look at the description down below, where I have links to my Discord and my Patreon page. But I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye!